Hello everybody, it's a Mustachio Yoshi welcoming you back to some more Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. Last time, we helped the lighthouse worker, uh, or worker repair... We saved a worker from terrible fate involving some Chromar. This time, well, let's make our way to gather some quests that I have not seen yet. I am getting way too sidetracked right now, <laughs> but we should get those quests. We have Valarin. Ah, hello there. Could I bother you for a second? I really need some help right now. My son has just gone missing. I'm really sorry, but could you help me look for him? Sounds like you've got a problem. Well, Shulk, is this our cue? Yep, we should do whatever we can. He just disappeared the second I took my eyes off him. I can't believe this has happened. I can't leave here either. My daughter is here, you see. She can be pretty naughty, too. So I have to keep an eye on her. If I take her with me to look, it'll just take too much time. So please, help me. Find Atayel. He can't have gone too far. He's only a child, after all. Really, thanks for helping. No problem, leave it to me. Nothing can stand the way when me and Shulk are on the case. You just take it easy and sit tight. Let's give it all we got, Ryan. Oh, well, would you look at that? Quest complete right here. And... A vision of the future. So these are the Imperial family's beloved star drops. We have collected all five. We should take them to her. Okay, well I do believe we have found Atayel. Where am I? I hope I can get back to Dad and my sis. Dad asked you to come and find me? Thanks. I know he's close, but I didn't know how to get back to him from here. It, it, it was literally just walking... this way. <laughs> Through the flowers. What is it? Thank you for finding my son. He's promised not to go off without telling me again. You really saved the day. I'm glad everything worked out. Right, it was well worth the effort. My son is so full of energy, I can't keep up sometimes. But I'm still to blame for laying him out of my sight. Please, take this. A little thanks from me. We get Tension Swing 3 from this. And we have another quest from Valarin. What is it? Oh, it's you again. Please, a moment of your time. I have another favor to ask. It's my dart. She's gone missing too. Sounds like you've got a problem. You're not getting us mixed up in uh, someone else's problems again. You're too soft, you are. Still Shulk Scobby Shulk. Ryan, I know you want to help just as much as I do. So, let's hear what's up. I still can't leave my son alone. I know he promised to behave, but he's just a child, you know? 
I'm really sorry, but could you please help me again? I think it's great when kids are being kids. And I guess being a kid means getting yourself lost sometimes. But you must be happy to see your children full of life, right? Of course it makes me happy. Seeing my kids happy and active makes me happier than anything. But I'd hate for anything to happen to them, so I can't help but worry. So now we have to find Sian. I knew I could count on you. Thanks for helping. No problem, leave it to me. Yes, I too will give it my all. And we look at that, they're right here. <laughs> In the war, nonetheless. Come and see. Eek, you found me! Huh? You're not my brother? Daddy's been looking for me? I was just playing hide and seek. Daddy worries too much. I bet he was crying. I'd better go back. Bye bye. Well, let's talk with uh, Valarin again. What is it? My Dar's saving sound. All thanks to you. You've taken good care of both my son and daughter. I'm glad everything worked out. Excellent job, Shulk. You're really going up fast. Uh, growing up fast. R really? That means a lot coming from you. I won't let you down. Here, take this. It's not much, but thank you. You found the lost child and returned her safely to her father. We get strength up four. And with that, we actually, hmm, we're, pre we're getting pretty close to unlocking some nice skill trees here. Or not unlocking, I mean, we have some skill links. Ooh, allows low value items to be offered when trading. That's great. Uh, AP for all, EXP for all, buy stuff would be good. Um, well, we can get rewarding work for from Dun uh, for Shulk from Dun Man. Um, Okay, well, Ryan's already got all that. Um, overwhelming. Hmm. And for Shulk. Yeah, we'll get overwhelming for him. Hmm. I see. Ooh, Mining Master would be great. And for Arts, we can level up a, a few of them, actually. Um, Let's level up Minato Purge. That way we have all of our Minato Arts leveled up currently. And then... Level up Light Heal. There. As for Rhine, level up Sword Drive, level up Shield Bash, Rage, Engage, 
not Berserker, unfortunately. Anchor Chain. That's a new one. Um, let's see if... Yeah, there's Thunder. Heat Haze? Okay, let's look at Charla's Arts. Okay, we have Heal Counter. Alright, next up is Ricky. Who has some new arts here? Level up Lurgy, behave. Alright, that's pretty well all of them so far. Let's go to the Fountain of Hope and get some quests from there. Because we will have to complete these sooner or later, so... Well. Lately, our friends have been arguing a lot. We don't know the reason, it's getting Ariel down too. So I had an idea, listen. I want to give something to Ariel to cheer her up. Think you could help me collect some star drop flowers? I've got everything else, I just don't have time to collect those. So we need to collect five star drops in Alchemoth. Oh, that's wonderful. I was really struggling for time. Thank you so much for helping me with this. Well, would you look at that? It actually tracks where these star drops are. So we already have two of five. Going on to three of five. Soon to be four of five. And we have a quest over this way. Let's go get it. Is it an Alchemoth citizen or is it a named character? Is it an Alchemoth citizen? What is it? Ever heard of White Tails? Pillows made from them will give you a really good night's sleep. I washed my one wrong and made it go all hard. I wonder why that happened. Well, luckily for this Alchemoth citizen, we already have enough for this quest. You really get me a couple of white tails. That would be a massive help. I can't wait. <coughs> No problem, leave it to me. Nothing can stand in the way when me and Shulk are on the case. You just take it easy and sit tight. Let's give you all we got, Ryan. With that, the quest has been completed. You got our 22,000 gold. And I think some more quests actually opened up for us. And this one's probably an Alchemoth citizen. Imperial Guard! Yes? We're behind with maintaining the air defenses of Alchemoth. We're all up to our necks in it. I hardly get to see my family and they're worried about me. I want to give my child a cool doll as a present, but... I just don't have the time to get the materials. It's asking a lot, I know, but... Could you collect some Oluga slacks for me? I mean, nothing says cool like Oluga slacks, right? Collect three Oluga slacks from Orlugas at Air of Sea. Sorry for causing such a bother. But I am really grateful to you for helping me. 
Now I can make a really cool doll from a child. Furthermore, we have this knob on here. Papipo. Yes. Nello is also part of my family, so I must be nice to Nello. But Nello is bad influence on Little Pawn. He should drink less. Yes. Recently, Papipo's son no want to go outside. I ask why, but he no answer. He just shiver and shake. What is happening? Sounds like you've got a problem. We'll hear you out. Tell us what's wrong. He does go out, but every day find new tricky place to hide. I want him to have fun outside, not stay in dark place. Yeah, kids should be playing outside with their mates. I don't know what I'd do if I didn't have friends to save my bacon. So, I'd love it if you'd let me help. You be careful now. I might get lovey-dovey for you. You very nice, home home, Handsome home home. But tough job for one, home home. Talk with friends and then decide what you do. Talk to Baroba. You are all nice people. I am all smiley smiles. But about my little pawn Baroba, I not know what's wrong with him. I want you to ask Baroba. No problem, leave it to me. Yes, I too will give it my all. Well, Baroba's right here, so we might as well talk with him. Reason why Baroba not go out? Simple. When walk outside, end up getting quick grab, cuddle, lift Baroba up. Baroba not like when that happen. If Baroba smell bad, maybe, maybe that solve problem. Will friends bring smelly thing? Whatever that smelly thing is. Oh, Ether Roses from Satoru Marsh. Oh, we'll leave that for later. Let's talk with the Alchemoth Citizen. Yes. My co-workers covered for me after I messed up at work. I want to make them a present, but I don't have the materials. If at all possible, could you find the materials I need, please? It might be a bit tough. What I'd like is something you get from Lunar Gratis at Aerith Sea. I've always wanted to use them to make a present. Thanks for agreeing to help. that, we've got 22,500 gold. For collecting a star drop, nonetheless. Alright, and we have another Alchemoth citizen here. What is it? I got something from a merchant I met and became friends with. I should have been more careful, but I think I lost it somewhere. Sorry, but could you help me look for it, please? Find the merchant's gifts somewhere on the lower level of Alchemoth. Y you're really going to help me look for it? There's no way I'd have found it by myself. I'm grateful for your kindness. Also, I want to check Collectopedia, not items. Collectopedia, not heart to hearts. Collectopedia! 
Uh, we still don't have the remaining items we need for the Cleptopia, but we did get some of the items earlier. We just gave them for a quest. Hey. On my daily stroll on Anu Shore, I saw a terrible monster. I think this is a hazard to all. Could you do something about it? Defeat Lightspeed Sonnet in the area of Anu Shore at Air of Sea. I am in your debt. I told the Imperial Guard of this too, you know. But they take ever so long making preparations. Thank you very much for taking this task up. Oh, it sounds like the people of Alchemoth are practically at their wit's end. When it comes to, uh... The Alchemoth Imperial Guard, that is. And the I am the individual is looking for, the Merchant's Gift, is right here. With that, we got 11,000 gold plus 2,500 experience. Or 2,750. Which is a nice amount of experience to get, if I do say so myself. That Kellyan really is alright. Onward we go. And, well, once we reach the top of this escalator, we have more quests. I'm a little surprised, honestly. We have Talon. Where, they, where could they be? The textbook doesn't have many details at all. Hey, could you help me with something? When I grow up, I want to become a scientist. Right now, I'm trying to find out about this particular bug. It's really cool. Sounds like you've got a problem. I've heard that after they hatch, they glow for a little bit. But I've only seen pictures of it in my textbook. That's why I want to see it at least once per reel. A glowing insect. The only species I know like that would be the gold caterpillar. Could that be what you're after? Yeah, that's it! A gold caterpillar. It inhabits the lower Bionis, but I have no idea where. I thought you might know because your homes and all. We need nine gold caterpillars from Tefer K. <laughs> Thanks. I heard that they like really dark and damp places. But my stupid textbook just says they're on lore by honest. No problem, leave it to me. All right, well, we now know a rough idea of what we're looking for, and it's in Tefra Cave. All right, well, we have quite a few quests this way. It's going to be a long walk around, but it'll be worth it. The monsters at Arab Sea have become more active recently. But naturally, there's nothing to worry about here in Alchemoth. But I think I'd like to help too. Instead of just leaving it all to the Imperial Guard like always. I'm going to pay capable warriors to go on subjugation missions. 
Well, are you interested? Defeat five Yunin Hodes at Air of Sea. You'll take up my offer. Excellent. Mm. The location is Shodan Clough. <sighs> Complete the mission and the money is yours. Take care, okay? What is it? There are still some monsters that need subjugation. This is to help protect Alkamoth. How about it? Give it a shot? Two Tokos or Luga at Air of Sea. They should be on Gatori. Take care, okay? May fortune smile on you. What is it? There is another monster wanting a good subjugation. You'll make Alkamoth safer. How about you can do it, right? Defeat one Pelargos Echidno at Air of Sea. Thanks for taking the contract. You can find one on Katoral Seal Island or in the Hode Refuge. I'm counting on you. These all may just be regular selling quests, but they offer a lot of gold at this point in the game, which you are going to need gold. Especially for a lot of the uh, Colony 6 Reconstruction stuff. Me. I'm really getting into dancing. I'm even making my own outrageous costumes. But I'm lacking in something rather important. You there. Please go and fetch it for me. Collect five Orluga grass skirts from Orluga in Machna Forest. I take it that you know Machna Forest, yes? I need five Orluga grass skirts from there. Now remember, they're delicate, so don't put them on or anything. Very well, we will not put those skirts on. So, let us move forward and get the quest that's all the way over that way. It's going to be a long walk, though. Yeah, there's not really any lamps, so how do they get those holograms up? It's so interesting. I wonder if there's a heart to heart that talks about. Uh... <laughs> yeah, it involves getting million Charlotte's of Fanny up to a certain point. don't have enough. I need more. I wait and I wait for days, but it doesn't come. Ah, I can't take it anymore. Collect three lots of gold burdock at RFC. The gold burdock spiba is truly a girl's best friend. I'm feeling a little bloated. Do you follow? It hurts. So, go to Air of Sea and get me some right away, please. Hmm. Yeah, that would be helpful to get for... Uh, for the individual in question. We'll have to head out anyhow, so... Hmm.
Onward we go. I actually like this solid Warfan too. It's quite nice. How's things? Please don't tell me you're working for the Imperial Palace. You're not. Oh, thank Bionis. I've been ordered to do something. I have to study monsters' ecology and then subjugate them. But it's just impossible for me. I'm just far too weak. This is my first job, too. I thought it was just going to be a normal office job, you know? Defeat five cruise pagools at LFC. Really? You won't go and defeat the monsters for me? Oh, I'm really grateful. Go forth and vanquish five cruise pagools for great justice. Tee <laughs> I always wanted to say that. How's things? It wasn't just Cruz Pagul's I had to survey, unfortunately. If you're going to Arab Sea anyway, you could help me again. I haven't surveyed birds since I was at school. But that was just a tiny little bird that all kids had to survey. I guess this time I have to do it properly. Defeat three Aerophansels at Aerof Sea. Oh, I'm so grateful. Please defeat three Aerophansels. They love to come up to people because they want to play. So, don't disappoint them, okay? How's things? Actually... It isn't just the Cruz Pagools and Arathansels I need to survey. One more. Just one more. Just one last tiny subjugation. This is honestly the last thing. Please. Please. Defeat two Zaconia Echidnos at Aerith Sea. Hey, I'm not bad, this whole manipulating thing. What? No, I didn't say anything. Don't be so paranoid. Right, this time the target is to defeat two Sikonia Echidnos. It's only a couple, so it'll be easy. Okay. Next we have another Alchemoth Citizen quest. What is it? I write music in my spare time. I write and play entirely original love songs. Don't you think that's so trendy? I've just got a new girlfriend, so I'd like to craft a new instrument. That's right, you guessed it. I don't have enough materials. Collect two Lexos beers from Rakdai Lexus at Air of Sea. You look like such gentle souls, so I decided to try and ask you. I need two Lexus beards from some Rakdai Lexus. Are you that? And we have a lot of gold, so let's buy arts manuals. And while we're at it, we can actually buy some armor for Shulk. Um, hmm. I don't know about popular stuff yet. We'll wait on that. I think. Um, Hunting Nibbler would be great for Ricky. Iron Cutlass. Yeah, that'd be good on Dunman. Hmm. Or I could go... Ace Lancer on Rhine. Okay, let's... Hmm. Hmm. So let's get five sky caps.
Hmm, we can only get five or uh, four sky tops, so. Okay. Sky cap, sky top. And let's add strength up four on Shulk. And. Tension swing three. Furthermore, I'd like to get strength down three on the Minato. And. Do have HP up two already. Okay. Slow resist three. Process resist three. For Dunben, we'll put on the sky cap, which will give him a giant up like eye patch. So we'll add physical protect four. Um, I think strength up three would be good. And we'll put on Sky Top on Sharla. As for Ricky, we'll put Sky Cap on. He looks great with Sky Cap, honestly. I think Ricky would be. It'd be good to have weapon power, too. As well as Agility up three, Ether up three. Strength up two. Oh, we have some more heart to hearts here. But we can't view it yet. Understandable. And it's an Alchemoth Imperial Guard. Yes. My senior officer gave me orders to go on a subjugation mission. But if he can't feed the target, how am I supposed to do it? Doesn't it make you furious? No, you don't have to hide it. I can see you're filled with rage. I've got a great idea. Why don't you go and save me? So now we have to defeat Peeling Kirchels on Hovering Reef 7 at Air of Sea. Great, I'd expect no less from mighty heroes like you. On Hovering Reef 7 looks Peeling Cacheus. But you're really quite strong, so you'll sort him out in no time. Righto, better go and report. What's up this way? <laughs> I'm curious now, what's up this way? We don't need to go any further, we should go back. Oh, come on, Shulk, aren't you curious? No, Shulk! Shulk! Make our way up here. Hey, 
And while we're at, we'll speak to this palace attendant. Yes? Please accept my humble gratitude for rescuing the repair worker. You must be tired. Please, feel welcome to rest. Let's rest. Everyone's gathered outside. How come we didn't get invited? It looks like some kind of ceremony. My loyal and beloved subjects, Saurian Antiqua speaks. I have been your emperor for little more than 20 years. But today I stand before you in celebration. So that's the High Entia Emperor, Saurian Antiqua. I will remain your emperor for years to come. But now is the time to announce my successor. May I introduce your crown princess. And there's the lady herself. Melia Antiqua. It's... it's her. She's... she's a princess. Took you long enough. Uh, her silver spoon accent was a clue. But royalty? My daughter, Melia Antiqua, will depart immediately to face the tomb. She will seek the approval of our ancestors and become your crown princess. The people are fickle. No mask can hide that girl's contaminated blood. First consort, all the pieces are in place. Say the word and the captive Homs shall be no more. The savage who discovers fire remains a savage. Disappointed or not, his highness will turn a blind eye to their fate. And their removal will deprive Melia of some powerful allies. As you say. Mother? We continue to endure the contamination of our bloodline by perpetuating this wretched tradition of a high Entia first consort and a Hom second consort. For how long must I suffer these Homs? Do your duty, Tyrea. As you wish. That mask. Melia. I don't doubt that was Melia. But why the mask? I don't know. But she's different from the other Hyentia. How do you mean? Melia not like other bird people. Many like Hom Hom friends. You might be right. But there are things at play here we can't understand. Wait a minute! Oi! You'll give a Homs a heart attack shouting like that? We've got no time to lose. Melia needs our help. Again? You had another vision, didn't you? What did you see? 
Out with it already. Excuse me. We ordered room service an hour ago. I'm afraid you've already eaten your last meal. Oh. All right. We have to defeat these and high end here. But we should be able to go right through them quickly. They're level 34, so they're not going to be a big deal. The only difference is that since Shulk uses Manal, he cannot hurt beings of Bionis, but Dunban and Ryan can do so just fine. Alright. Let's inflict, inflict Topple. Worldly Slash? Alright, we got the topple lock. Okay, that dealt two damage. Let's go with Hammer Beat. Worldly Slash. Which will defeat that Guard India. Now we have another Scout India here. Okay, we inflicted days and they're down. Who are these guys? Shulk. These are inquisitors. What is this? More of them! Wait! This is His Highness Kallion, brother to Her Highness Melia. Melia's brother? Do not concern yourself, Your Highness. The matter appears to have been resolved. Seer Alvis? I foresaw the danger. I rushed here, but seem to have missed the fun. They do not look like mere thieves. I am presuming they are inquisitors of the Bionite Order. A group of assassins long devoted to the Imperial family. Ridiculous. The Bionite Order are a mere... Myth. The Order existed before records began. I, like many others, believed they had long since died out. Yet here they are before us. Is Father aware of this? I suspect he knows very little. He may not even be aware of their existence. They live amongst the shadows, never revealing their true faces. But that does not explain why they would attack these people. Wait, could that have been... No, there's no way. Kallion, Melia is in danger. She'll be killed at an altar if we don't find her soon. Killed? How can you be so sure? Shulk and I share the same gift. Another seer? Which would mean that you can see the future? That's why we have to find her. Now. Your Highness. As agreed, 
You will face the ritual alone. I thank you for escorting me. We wish you a safe return. As history has proven, all those who stake claim to the throne without merit will spend eternity as fallen spirits. I must prove my worth as the next ruler, and I am no less prepared to sacrifice my life than those that have fallen before me. Most wise, Your Highness. Watch your back, Your Highness. Unacceptable. Those who enter the tomb must do so alone. Her life or death is in the hands of fate. Those not worthy of the throne are exactly that. You can't seriously think that. This is your sister. This is Melia. Easy, Ryan. But Dumban. This ritual holds a special significance. It is wrong for us to interfere. I don't like it. But am I right in saying that the rules of this ritual affect only Hyentia? And if some strange Homs happen to get involved, it wouldn't cause a problem. Or is there some rule that prohibits Homs from entering the tomb? No, I suppose not. Then look at it this way. I don't need to know how big a deal this ritual is to your people. What I do know is that your sister's life is at stake. Cut us a break, and we'll save her. Who are you? My name is Dunban. I'm sort of the protector of this mechon bashing band of Homs. Dunban. I know you. At the Battle of Sword Valley, you held back an entire wave of mechon with the Monado. You know a lot about a battle you never showed up to. My apologies. We do not concern ourselves with the wars of others, be it against the Mekon or otherwise. I was only joking. You had your reasons. I can see that with all these defense systems, you don't really need to fight. Then it is decided. You can reach the tomb by transporter from the center gate. Her Highness has already entered. Shulk, you should hurry. All right, with that, we have Alvis in our party. And I think that this is a good place to leave off. Next time on Zombie Chronicles of Fan Edition, we will begin making our way to the High Entia Tomb. This has been Masashi Yoshi signing off. Have a good one. Peace!